Good morning, Dr. Eric Klajinski here, Fanwood Back Relief Center, <clears throat> excuse me, offering convenient, affordable chiropractic care. Today we're going to talk about some common shoulder sports injuries. It's reported that uh, greater than 50% of shoulder injuries occur in college football, um, usually due to a lot of the pushing, um, uh, repetitive stress on that joint. Um, but shoulder injuries, though most commonly from over um, overhead movements, um, they can result as, uh, can be damaged as a result of any type of repetitive stress, like we see in sports where pitchers, tennis players, golfers are excessively using that joint and putting it to, to, to the use of failure. Um, I want to talk about a few different types of injuries we see in our office. Number one is a slap tear. There's a rim of cartilage uh, called the labrum that's in the shoulder. Uh, and when this gets injured, uh, what happens is it kind of feels like the shoulder is going to pop out of its socket. There could be weakness, there could be lack of range of motion, and of course there's usually a deep ache uh, in uh, trying to attempt to you know, bring any type of weight overhead. Uh, so we'll see these a lot with uh, weightlifters, uh, powerlifters, um, uh, CrossFit athletes, uh, when there's a lot of repetitive heavy lifting above the shoulders. So slap tear. Another common injury is a dislocation um, or even shoulder instability tear. These, are in, uh, these types of injuries occur where the, sh the shoulder is actually out of the joint. Um, typically, it's a sudden movement or jarring motion of the arm or the shoulder that causes this to occur. Again, there's going to be uh, periods of bursts of pain, lack of mobility, stiffness uh, in that joint space. Another most common injury is a tear. Uh, there can be a tear of multiple tendons in the shoulder, and we see this most commonly with repetitive stress sports like uh, baseball players that are constantly throwing the ball, uh, tennis players, golfers like we mentioned before, uh, swimming also is another one. And what they will present with will be definitely a reduced range of motion, uh, especially from the over, over going overhead or to the back, um, and there's usually a deep local, localized ache in the shoulder. Um, so these are just three common injuries of the shoulders that we see in the office. Um, most of the time, shoulder injuries presented in our office can be treated in our office. Uh, occasionally, a, a patient will come in and it's going to require uh, surgical intervention. And if that's the case, we send you out to the pro appropriate orthopedic surgeon to make sure it's taken care of properly and uh, swiftly. If it's not a full thickness tear or it doesn't require surgery, um, the, the, best, the best type of treatment is early on care which will, can include you know, ice, ice and heat, contrast therapy, um, stretching, mobilization, uh, spinal manipulation when warranted uh, to make sure that the joint is sitting properly um, in the socket um, and also strengthening exercises can be done both in the office and at home. Uh, we also use other modalities, electrical, electrical stim, ultrasound, uh, class four deep tissue laser, which decreases the inflammation. All these things are really good if, um, if, if you know, implemented early on in the, in the care. Uh, whatever the case may be, if it's something we can handle here, we will definitely uh, do our best to take care of it. If we need to refer you out to a physical therapist um, or an orthopedic, we will do that as well if we're not getting the results after a few treatments. Uh, if you have any questions about your type of shoulder injury, maybe you experience playing sports, weightlifting, uh, maybe it's a chronic repetitive use due to your job, um, just give us a call. We ha we'd be happy to kind of point you in the right direction and provide you the care or information that you need to get better quickly. Uh, if you like the video, please like it. Uh, we're very grateful for you guys that like the videos, that comment and that share them. We, we appreciate your support. And again, if you need any more information, just shoot me a message, give us a call. You can visit our website at fanwoodbackbelief.com. Have an awesome day. We'll talk to you next time. Thanks for watching.